Welcome guys. On today's video, I'm going to show you how to see the pages that you liked on Facebook. Now, to see the pages that you like, either the older ones, let's say 2022, 2023 and so, and also if you want to unlike them or unfollow them, this is the video for you. Now, let's get on with it. If you are on Facebook, go ahead and visit your profile area. Now, click on the three dotted icon just below the edit button, right? You see the three dotted icon right there. You click on it. And then you go to activity log scroll down a little bit and you select activity log now when you click on activity log it's going to bring you to this area now the next thing you need to do is to scroll down a little bit and then you are going to see uh pages this area pages page like and interest right you click on that now um when you click on this it's going to load up all of the pages that you like now you can see every pages that i like they are all displaying here. I like this particular page, uh, 24th March, 2025. I cannot even remember who this person is. So um, to unlike this page or to see the page, you right click on the name next to your profile name. This is my profile name, Trust Stanley. And then you right click on the name and then you either open it on a new link or you just click on it to open on the same link. I want to open it on a new link because I want that page to remain there. Now you can go ahead and scroll what the page is all about and to see if you know the person. I cannot recognize this person. I probably maybe liked it by mistake. So in order for me to unfollow or unlike this page, all I need to do, you can see it says following. Just come below and then click on the drop down area. Hold on, not that. I do not want to block the person because, okay, um, just click on the following again and then unfollow. I do not know the reason why it did not pop up then, that's the reason why I went down. So you click on unfollow and then it unfollows the page. So um, then um, it's going to update, if it doesn't update, go ahead and refresh. You can notice it's still there, go ahead and refresh. But unlike the mobile, on the mobile, when you unfollow or unlike somebody, it still appears. I don't know. I think it's actually a bug from them. So you can notice it's no longer displaying. So we can also do the same for the next person and so on and so forth. And if you, for some reason, want to unlike everybody, you can go ahead and click on all and then you click on remove. So when you click on all, it's going to remove them immediately. This does not work on mobile, it only works on PC. Now you can see it says uh, 25 selected. Now if you do not want to select that, this is my real friend, uh, a very close friend of mine, I'm going to deselect. So it's going to show everything on this page, 25, right? Before you now start scrolling down. So most of them over here, um, I think I do not know them. So, um, okay, this is Facebook uh, Meta I unlike. I deselect, deselect because I do want to follow them and match Roya on follow, follow Apex. I do not want to unfollow Apex. I still like that game. So um, most of these guys uh, lost communication and I cannot remember them. So um, if you want to unfollow all of them, just click on remove and you can notice it says uh, remove interaction and then you go ahead and do remove. Now, when you do remove, um, it's going to ask you for your password. I have my password already saved, so I would not enter it manually. So you can notice it says, for security reason, you will need to re-enter your password to take bulk action. I click on continue. Funny thing, it already showed me the password area, so I already entered that. But then it doesn't do that immediately. You notice it takes a while and then it removes them. You can see they are no longer displaying. Now, how about the older pages that you liked, like I mentioned in the beginning of the video? Now you click, you notice left on this left area, it says date. You click on the date and then you choose the exact date that you want to go ahead and follow those people for. So um, you can notice it says all dates. Now you can click on the date to drop down and then you select, let's say, 2023 and then you click on save changes. Then it's going to update all of the pages that I follow 2023, but there is none of them. The reason is because uh, 2023, I really, I really make made use of social media so it did not show anything this is 2022 uh let me go ahead and go back i cannot remember exactly when i created this account but i just know that i do not follow so many people on social media and also even the people that i follow um are not really that much 
So this is 2020. Uh, this is Sean Connell. Everybody knows that. Uh, if, you, if you don't know him, he's a, a content creator also. He makes interesting content. You can actually check him out. This is a tech burner. He also makes tech content. I like him. Um, I don't know why he says uh, trust like, trust like. Probably the activities I did that period. Dude Perfect, I like. YouTube, I like. Um, Auto Talk Cozy. I am going to unfollow this. So I'm going to go ahead and check all of the people that I want to unfollow and then I will go ahead and unfollow them. I'm not really into cars. Why exactly did I follow all this? Okay, I think I'm actually done. Now all I need to do is to go right back up and then I will hit remove. And then when you hit remove, it is going to remove all of the pages that you selected. So guys, thank you for watching the video to this, uh, this lens. I hope it's helpful. And um, we couldn't do this on mobile, but it works perfectly well on PC. I wonder why they did not make it to work like that on mobile. But if you have further question or you, have, you still want to use mobile to do this, that you do not have a PC, let me know on the comment section and I will make a video for that because there is actually a way around it. So um, thank you for watching, guys. I will see you on the next one. Stay safe and peace.